about a bill before the Florida legislature. It has to do with radioactive material and road construction in the Sunshine State. Last week, Florida lawmakers approved a bill that would enable the use of the toxic material for new roads all over the state. We're on your side with how both sides of this argument say they're looking out for the environment. They look like mini mountains in Florida, but they're actually huge mounds of radioactive material. Because it's simply too unsafe to do anything with. The mounds, hundreds of feet tall and hundreds of acres wide, are made of phosphogypsum, also known as PG. It's the byproduct of phosphate. So when phosphate fertilizer is made, so is PG. The federal government says PG is too toxic to do anything with except store it like this. The Environmental Protection Agency says all uses of phosphogypsum waste have been banned unless the waste has very little radioactivity. But Florida lawmakers voted last week to use it as a road construction material, giving the Department of Transportation until the end of the year to study it. Here's the bill's sponsor. Hey, um, the DOT's suitability study absolutely contemplates worker safety, exposure limits, environmental impacts. More than 35 environmental groups from across the southeast U.S. doubt that and have we have sent a veto request to Governor DeSantis urging him to veto these bills and prioritize the health and safety of Floridians in our environment. Reagan Whitlock with the Center for Biological Diversity says the use of PG could be toxic for the ecosystem next to any roads built with it, let alone construction workers who handle it. The bill's sponsor admitted PG is radioactive, but said there are regulations both on the federal and state level to ensure that all Floridians, including the construction workers that would be uh, working with this material, are safe. If the EPA says it can't be used, Florida can override that? Florida lawmakers can override that? Florida will need to send a, an application to the Environmental Protection Agency asking to be able to use this stuff in roadway construction. Some people in the phosphate industry say something has to be done with that material in the large mounds, while others say putting that radioactive material on roads across the state is not the answer. Okay, again, so the bill has passed both houses. It is now waiting uh, before Governor DeSantis to see if he will sign it or veto it.